Christmas is right around the corner, but Santa made an early stop to celebrate the holiday with terminally ill children and their families right here on the Sun Coast. SNN's Nicole Somavilla has the story. Flight to the North Pole started in 1985. Santa, local volunteers, and the Manatee County Sheriff's Office bring Christmas to terminally ill children and their families a little early. It's their day. It's a special day for them. We send them a wish list. Whatever they put down on that list, they will be getting today from Santa. Soraya Young's favorite part has hooves. I can ride the horses and eat with Santa. For many, a gift doesn't come from the sled. Natalie Woodruff was born with her heart on the wrong side, and her cardiologist just cleared her for flying. So seeing all these airplanes and Santa flying in the sky is especially exciting for her. Because there's people that fly in there. And you know who else is flying in the air? No. Santa. I didn't know that. In her stocking, a Disney Elsa sing-along doll. You have to sing it when she starts. And you have to, when she ends, you have to stop. The Sarasota Bradenton Airport Fire Department filled with clowns, a toy shop, and don't forget face paint. It was pretty, and, it's, and it is a uh, princess. And the season of giving has only just begun. The big payoff is the smile on their faces. Reporting in Manatee County, Nicole Somavilla, SNN, Suncoast News Network. And the Sheriff's Office says the 31st annual flight to the North Pole would not be possible without all those gracious volunteers.